We all need things that can better our lives. The quality of our lives is more often than not dependent on the habits we keep. What type of habits are you currently cultivating? Are they healthy habits? Can they help you grow? Great habits can change your life. In this video, I'll share with you 9 healthy habits that can change your life. 1. Quit binge watching movies. I know it's your favorite show, and it's on every day. But are you getting enough sleep? Sometimes we can't have everything we want. We have to sacrifice them for the greater good. You're ultimately no good to anyone if you're ill from lack of sleep. Binge watching also means you're not really doing something productive with your time. It also means you don't plan your day ahead of time. It is really not something you want to get into. If you're already doing this, try sleeping by 8 p.m. If you try and you still can't, try reading a book. I guarantee you'll fall asleep in less than an hour. When you're young, you're meant to maximize your time, planning and executing. You have a lot of dreams to birth. It really isn't a time for binge watching. It is a time luxury you cannot afford now. Wealthy and successful people spend their time building their wealth and creating business strategies. If you must stay up, at least spend the time working on your goals. 2. Get enough sleep. You may think you're fine, but you're not. Sleeping 5 hours a day is no good. You need at least 8 hours of sleep a day. Yes, I know you're busy, but we all have a lot to do too. We each have 24 hours in a day. If you spend just 1 hour daily working on your goals, you'll be very successful in society. This is as long as you're consistent. Sleep can make a difference in the quality of your work. When you don't get enough sleep, you'll produce poor quality of work. Your mind will not get enough time to recover from yesterday's work. Sometimes, even taking a power nap can come in handy. Most modern offices have a lounge for recreation and power naps. If you feel dizzy at work or you just can't seem to get any work done, it may be a good idea to take a quick nap. It can work miracles. People who sleep well tend to be more alert at work too. The benefits are just so many. 3. The clutter. Having too many things around you that you don't need not only clutters your apartment, but also clutters your mind. Imagine trying to brainstorm in a room that had two months worth of laundry. You may not even know where your pen and notebook is. Having stuff is not bad, but having things you don't need can really make you feel surrounded. You need space to breathe. According to Quartz, a 2012 study suggests that spending four days immersed in nature will improve creative problem solving by 50%. Now you know why you need space. Nature has a lot of fresh air and space. There are trees, but they are not clustered together. The more organized your apartment is, the better you can think and plan. This is a healthy habit to cultivate. It can help you save the time spent looking for things you should know where they are. It can also improve the ventilation in your apartment. 4. Eat healthy. Many of us don't like to hear this. We want what we want, right? But is it really the best? According to Medicine Net, one of the top capsules of obesity is frequent eating. You may want to cut down on doughnuts. Foods high in fat are the problem. You can avoid all this by only eating healthy. Eating an orange once a week is a start, but it isn't good enough. Eating healthy is hard work. You have to have a diet plan, whether or not you have gained some pounds. Your meals have to be classified and altered within the week. That way, you are not getting any type in excess. This is usually also combined with an exercise routine to burn excess calories. Even if you have gained some pounds, it still doesn't matter. It is never too late to start. What matters is your willingness to commit to doing better for yourself. If you eat healthy, you would not have to worry about many health-related issues in life. 5. Exercise regularly. This is part of a lot of successful people's routines. Exercise keeps you in shape and fit. You also get to release pent-up energy by doing a physically engaging activity. This is a very healthy habit that can help you in all areas of your life. Humans tend to model things down to other things. Their minds cannot tell the difference. If they are honest at home, they tend to be honest at work. If they are organized at work, they tend to be organized at home. If you are consistent with exercising, you would also tend to be consistent at work, fulfill your goals and keep your commitments. It's a cycle of positivity. 6. Build your self-esteem. Your self-esteem is very central to your success in life. You need to believe in yourself in order for others to believe in you. A great way to build your self-esteem is by surrounding yourself with people who share your ideals. Hanging out with people you feel are successful, but do not miss the chance to call out your weaknesses when you make mistakes is a wrong move. Be careful about your associations. If you associate with the wrong people, they can poke holes in your confidence. 
Read biographies of people you want to become. Try to understand their struggles and how they overcame, and remind yourself that you too will overcome. Building your self-esteem is a healthy habit that can keep you from depression and help you achieve your goals. 7. Start small. This is one of the most essential habits to build when you're young. Nothing big ever truly starts big. It always starts small. You need to remember this all the time because many people are frustrated because they don't have the resources to push their dreams. I agree that it can be frustrating. But then, those pursuing their dreams now probably had a time when they did not have the resources. Developing the habit of starting small to build gradually involves patience. You have to be patient. Growth is not a one-off process. It is a gradual process. What really counts is whether you're growing every day. If you want to become a millionaire, don't look at your account balance and dismiss your idea or goal. Start small. Every dollar counts. Build on it and grow at your pace. 8. Setting a daily target. Consistency is crucial to success. People need to come to associate with some value you create over a long period. This actually happens over time. Setting a daily target for yourself can do the trick. If you want to be known as a writer, how many words do you write a day? Is your writing consistent? If you want to be known as a speaker, how many times will you rehearse your speeches? Do you speak as though you are in front of thousands of people? Success truly only comes when opportunity meets preparation. How prepared are you for the future you desire? It is useful to see each target as a step towards your goals. Imagine successfully writing on a blog every single day for three years. Any serious writing outlet would hire you because of your consistency and probably good writing. You can create success for yourself if you're willing to invest in preparing yourself for it. 9. Reduce stress. This is a pretty useful habit. Especially for this times, it is easy to get lost in work these days. You are grateful you still have a job. The bills are not going away. You are also supporting your parents. You feel like there is no end, but you just have to keep going. You need to take a break. Work can be draining. Even if you have a lot of work on your table, take a break at least every one hour. You may be exaggerating the challenge. Give yourself time to process all information and always reread your emails for typos before sending them. The above are great healthy habits that can help you lead a happier and more fulfilling life. Try adopting one of them today. Who knows, it might just be what you need. If this video inspired you, subscribe to our channel. We love you.